this is, I've changed it from D back to the... Okay. So this is going to make it a lot easier for you. Yeah? yeah. Because when you pick finger pick, we've never ever totally covered finger picking, so this right. is going to be super, super basics. Okay. When you finger pick, it's not your whole hand brushes like a pick. Right, okay. Yeah, you literally... I just do it just so it makes a sound. <laughs> pick at it, yeah? Okay. Like that. Yeah. So what I want you to do, just as a bit of an exercise, let's do, let's take the two hardest chords there, is G and D, that, that yeah. alternation. So usually with finger picking, what I do, um, I finger pick quite a bit now because I play the acoustic guitar more, um, I never used to, so I kind of came up with like, what's the kind of cheaty way to, what's an yeah. easier way to view it? These three fingers yeah. tend to be on the highest three strings. Okay. Yeah. Or what happens is these two fingers go on that pair yeah. or that pair, okay. depending on what's being used. It tends to be these two fingers take the three highest strings, and your thumb takes these strings. Because usually, as you can tell from this song already as well, the, the bass notes or the lower notes of the chord um, don't yeah. get used as much either. Yeah, yeah. So you can have one finger that covers three strings. Because it's very little yeah. you're going to have to. Like do it with one finger, yeah. Whereas up here, yeah, you got loads. Like, <laughs> yeah, I didn't notice that. Like with more than words, it kind of is bass, and then everything else in that phrase mm -hmm. is like all the strings and also I'm like the percussion. I feel like yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, Try that again. So. So let's try okay. and cover the technique of, of finger picking. Okay, and uh, also, it's like, sorry, but with the finger picking, mm -hmm. do, is there like a special way to do that as well? Like, maybe... That's it. So it's really like it, it. Yeah, so it depends. If you, so this is the classical way to finger pick. Uh, okay. Where you have your hand kind of like this. I can't really do that. Yeah. Very, well, not very accurately, anyway. I tend to have, it's a very conventional style of having the wrist there. Okay. So see if you can try that with the wrist actually resting. Can you rest the wrist whilst you do it? Um, oh so God. just try. Just try. Okay. It's yeah, because it doesn't smell like yours is like a crystal clear sound. Mm -hmm. Mine's like more full. That's because you're going. Yeah. That across it. So this is going to be the technique. So super super easy. We're just going to take. We're going to take that that okay. part basically. So. We're gonna have say, thumb, the, the wrist, wrist on the bridge. So the only thing that's being picked with our fingers, or not our thumb, the only thing being picked with our fingers is the top two strings, isn't it? Yeah. That, those three. Can you have a listen? Yeah. It's just that's it. That's it. Yeah. Right. So we're not gonna extend the fingers. Notice when I my percussion comes from my nails hitting the string. Watch. It's just a rested hand, it's yeah. literally as light as... Yeah. Yeah, that's it, that's all it's doing. Just touch it. Okay. There's no intent in it, it's just a bit of percussion. Yeah? So, okay. what we're going to try and get down here is... So, so there's no of this anymore. I, I can't... None of this anymore. I'm that's what we're going to try out with. Okay. So, I'm just going to do... Your wrist on that thing and just go. I can't do that with that. I have two fingers. Ah, uh, okay. So yeah, so it's not the fingers going this way across. It's we're gonna we're picking up like yeah. that. Yeah. Okay. That's so really hard. It's difficult, yeah, but. Just go. It's so hard. No, if you get this, watch. If you get this, my hand pretty much just does this. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. yeah. But literally, the part that all I'm doing is pick fingers, pick fingers, yeah, yeah. pick fingers. This one, these fingers need to make sure they're on the right string. This thumb needs to make sure it picks the right string. Aye. That's it, yeah? So, all we're doing here... Can you get that clean sound again for me? Right. Oh, 
So just alternate, like a one and two and. Thumb, thumb is the numbers, fingers are the and. Okay. So we're going to go, so no percussion for yet, yeah? Percussion okay. is a later thing. So basically, a percussion is a whole other lesson, yeah? Really? To do, to not like it's just like a little, like... It's, it's a, you can just tap it, but that's when you've got the freedom of not having to think about what your fingers are doing. Yeah. For now, yeah? So we wouldn't say, if you couldn't hold the pick properly, I wouldn't ask you to alter the pick. Yeah. Yeah? So we take it step by step. So let's do, so this is what I need to play. This is, this is what it's going to sound, this is what it's going to sound like. Okay. So... Same part of the song, we're just playing it differently. Yeah. So it's going to be a one and two and three and four and, and all we're going to do is G, G, that B note on the A string. Yeah, you, you know what that is, the second fret. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then the C note. So super slow. So wrist up. So that's just your thumb changing. Okay, so stick on that B one. Watch it for now because it, you know, eventually your thumb will know that's the D, that's the A, that's the yeah. A. It'll know that eventually, but for now you can just look and make sure, okay, because this hand's not going to hurt you. I know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So you can just go. Yeah, it's yeah. really like watching the strumming on there because like, you never do, I never mm. do that. Yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> so try it again. I would just alternate okay. between the two. Take it up again. Oh, I'm not watching. I don't clue that is. I was just seeing that. Yeah? Look how clear that was. 